G'day guys, quick update on what I've been up to. This week I added some impatience to the pipes running along the veranda. This is the pond setup that used to be my patio aquaponics. Now it's testing the anoxic filter, but I still have all that pipe work set up along the veranda from when it was an aquaponics system. Anyway, the last couple of years I've been using it to grow impatience. I really love doing this as it brightens up the entire veranda. And best of all, it's no maintenance as the water from the pond is being circulated through the pipes, watering the roots of the plants. And this is perfect for impatience as they like lots of water but can't handle their foliage being wet all the time. Yet their roots completely submerged is fine. I've always loved the idea of planting certain annuals up on the veranda but I find that in the heat of summer, if I forget to water them just that once, it's all over. Um, but with these growing up here, with the water constantly circulating through their roots, this isn't an issue. So this year, in keeping with the anoxic filter theme, I decided to plant them into the kitty litter. Previously, I'd planted them into the little hydroponic pots and just filled them with the fired clay balls. And that works great, but those clay balls are expensive and kitty litter is cheap. So I wanted to try it so for other people, if they're looking to do something similar, they have a cheaper option. And what's even better is the kitty litter absorbs ammonia, which is more easily accessible for plants than nitrate is. So fingers crossed this leads to even better growth than I've had in the previous seasons. So this is a pretty easy setup that anyone could create. Uh, a little self-watering system like this using a small reservoir and some stormwater pipe with the holes just drilled in it for the pots to sit in. It's pretty cool. You get the sound of water and an easy to maintain garden bed. And if you want a few fish, you get that too. So that was just some of the fun that I was having this week. Uh, I'm thinking about trying some strawberries as well, or should I just stick with the impatience? Uh, you guys let me know down in the comments. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.